when the first Lord of the Rings came out. We were watching the behind the scenes and they were showing all the textiles people and all the people that are making all the props and armory and models. And I just couldn't believe that you could do that as a job. It's always amazing that someone could dream out something different, something that you didn't even know could exist. We are doing all the panels for Cleo House. So the Cleo House is where Catherine lives. Mostly it's sponging, colour, textile, print paste. Doing a lot of screen printing as well. I really like to draw trees. <laughs> so this is really perfect, yeah. So it's a really massive job. There's about 10 to 15 people. Everyone's got their own little style, but we're trying to keep it quite consistent as well. So we've got people that are full-time foiling everything to make them really sparkle. And we've got people down on the ground doing all the little shrubbery and things. It's very ethereal, very lush, but also quite airy and, yeah, calm. So it's really interesting working from such a tiny little sketch and doing it massively. It's pretty exciting to see it larger than you. Yeah. Uh, it's just too exciting to not do, and you miss it too much. If you know that you can do something for hours and you don't know that it's been hours, then it's probably something that you should be doing most of the time. Being a creative and being able to use your imagination is really special. It's not just in your head, and it's not something that you do when you're a kid and then you need to go get some other job. You can actually foster that imagination and make real things out of it and get better at doing what you do. My name is Hannah Webster, and I am a textile artist on Mortal Engines. <laughs>